chicken nuggets. Hello, hello, hello. And welcome to the Mallorca vlog. Woo. Oh. oh, hello. Hello. Look who's just arrived. And I like that she's holding cleaning supplies. <laughs> <laughs> Again, that's the only time you greet me. <laughs> As I was saying there, guys, I'm going to Mallorca. Woo! Yeah. Yeah, at least you know they lasted long. Mum got me these balloons for our roller coaster and live, and they're still standing. Mum, you were doing all the night. <laughs> but I'm all packed. This should be 20 kilograms. Where's my queen thing? Is it ready to zip up in a moment? No, I'm about to zip up. So I'm going to Mallorca, guys. Just saying bye to the flat. You know, I actually get a wee bit sad leaving my flat. Like, I'll always miss it when I'm away, but she's here when I get back. Um, but I'm going to Mallorca with Abigail, Abby and Monique, and we're going for a girls' trip. It's kind of turned out to be a wee bit of a work trip. Like, I have jobs that I can do there that I wouldn't have been able to do here. Because we're in a bikini in Glasgow at the start of March. It's just not making much sense. Need to go down to Pollock Summon Baths on, on the flume. <laughs> well, I'm going to have to get it early. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> yes, please. So my dad's going to drop me at Abigail's and then we're actually flying from Presswick, which is like 40 minutes away from Glasgow. So someone's going to pick us up from Abigail's and take us all to Presswick. So, yay, welcome to the Mallorca vlog. Woo! Right, don't take anyone's eye out, hen. Oh, I'm scared. I wouldn't have a clue how to open that. You open box all the time. <laughs> oh, balls. Popping bottles and then getting blizzard. <laughs> yeah. Woo! 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 Oh, oh, it might be hard. Oh, I've got that shaky hand. Yeah, you do have a shaky hand. I do have shaky hands. Oh! My daddy's pulling it back. Thanks, big daddy. Big daddy on the trip. Guys, what about this? So, we're heading off to um, Presswick Airport. What's your name, sorry? John. 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 The lovely John is taking us from late LAZ. LAZ -E. -E Executive Travel. Travel. I'll, go to, I'll put it on screen anyway, but gosh, we're riding in style, that's for sure. <laughs> ching ching. Our next holiday, we're definitely being humbled. I know. <laughs> Back to just Glasgow cabs. So. <laughs> so, obviously, we're all overweight, so we're having to try and shift some stuff. <laughs> Oh. But I can't move anything because it will all be over the limit. I honestly wonder what it's like just to pack like a normal human. Guys, I really feel like this is what 25 looks like on a plane. Wee bottle of wine, wee bit of Pringles in a book. Tell me you're 25 if I tell me you're 25. Everyone say hi. Hi. Girls. You can't tell we're on the plane. <laughs> we, we weren't meant to be sitting together, but we managed to locate some seats together. And when I first got on the plane, I was feeling a bit tipsy from all the Prosecco we've had. And I was trying to read my book. <laughs> my, my eyes were deceiving me on all the words. <laughs> so anyway, we're together now. A wee, a wee rosé. Cheers! Cheers. Oh. Hiya guys! It's well and truly been a minute I'm afraid um, but we were on the plane, we landed in Mallorca and then we're here in our wee apartment. I'll give you a room to tour tour in the morning. We just sat gab 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 doing what us gal gals do best. Oh we also had dinner in the restaurant. Actually Abby took a complete turn. That's where we've been. <laughs> I've totally missed a chapter. Um, Abby got really sick out of nowhere. <laughs> it's not funny, it was actually quite scary. Um, but we had to deal with poor Abby, but she's on the mend, she's absolutely fine. Abby! See, there's the proof, she's great. Um, but then we just sat, chat, 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 and we're just finished unpacking. This is my and Abigail's wardrobe. Me and Abigail have got a wee single bed each. So no canoodling. Nope. We'll be down the middle. <laughs> Imagine that we fall down and 
<laughs> wake up in tiles. When I was young, I used to always fall off my bed. Really? Yeah, like, because I am... So, guys, I don't know if I should actually get help about this. Nadine said I maybe should. I get really bad night terrors. Like, I have horrific dreams. Like, there's bad dreams and then there's the shit I'm dreaming of at night, right? The other night, I had a dream that I was at my cousin's girlfriend's fair elf, which I am going to in a couple of months. But my dream was that I was there, right? And it was in this, like, big conservatory. So you could see, obviously, outside, because conservatories are made of glass. And... Honestly, about 25 men start running towards the glass and everyone was like, check these guys out there, like, what are they up to? And they smashed through the glass and it all came to me with a knife and I woke up just as they were about to pierce my skin. Like, every night I wake up like, <gasps> and it's just not healthy. That's not right that I'm having dreams like that every night. I actually get scared to fall asleep because I think, what am I going to see tonight? So, that could potentially be worrying. But at least I've got Abigail here if I get scared <laughs> tonight. Hopefully no night terrors in Mallorca. Hopefully I've left them back home. But we're just... It's not actually getting an early night, to be honest. It is actually half past midnight. Crazy cats. But we're just chilled and we're going to get up tomorrow and seize the day. What's that What's that quote? Seize the day. Carpe diem. Carpe diem. Um, carpe diem tomorrow. So... The real fun starts then, and I will see you then. Good morning, good morning from Mallorca, guys. We've been up. We've actually been to the gym, that's right. She goes to the gym on holiday now. Um, this is the weather. I'll give you a wee look. I'll give you a wee villa tour as well. So, it's obviously nice blue skies, and it's not like freezing, but when the wind blows, it's cold. Don't be fooled, guys. So, this is our wee villa. This is mine and Abigail's room. And then we've got a proper wee house, you come in. Bathroom, bathroom check. And then this is Abby and Monique's room. We're having a problem with the air condition, it's absolutely roasting. Look at this wee sink they have, isn't that cute? Big bath, I fancy a wee bath in there, so I do. And then we come down, all the way down the stairs, and it's this one, we've got our own wee house. And this is our downstairs. Hello. Hey y'all. Our wee kitchenette. Oh. Oh. Hi. Hola. 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 Working. Sí. It's too hot. Sí. Too yeah. hot. Oh. <laughs> vale. Cold. He's in bed. Ah, sí, it's good. This is our living room. Outdoor area. Right, we're good. We're rolling. We're rolling. Right, so cheers, and everyone. So, guys, we do a cheers every time we have a drink, and a different spokesperson mm. goes every time, and it's actually my turn. <laughs> So cheers, girls, to being young, wild, and free. <laughs> cheers. <laughs> cheers. <laughs> okay. This is a little bit suspicious. Ooh. <laughs> what you can't even see. <laughs> I'm actually, wait, have you got to your torch? <laughs> Check where you can see it. You're not on the footpath. I'm, he I'm headed through the trees. <laughs> oh, my wee pal's stuck in the trees. <laughs> You'll see her, she's got... I'm grateful for my natural long hair. I'm grateful for my natural long hair. <laughs> You're so good at accents. <laughs> I'm terrible at accents. But oh. we're, we're off to the local... Oh, look at the stars. Look at the stars. Look how they shine for you. Wait, where are we going? Wait, I don't, no, wait, yeah, no, yeah, yeah. No? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. It, that looks like we're... I see light. We're <laughs> headed towards... I see life. <laughs> Why are we headed this way? Where, where there's a light. that's the way. Got to be, no? Mm. Is this the way to Amarillo? Every, Every night I've been hugging my pillow. Do you know that the song like the Falkirk football team was like? Na 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 Falkirk. Dear, we are. No, I'm not gonna lie. This, I, I, I don't like I feel this. like we're walking in chunks of grass. I'm scared. You want to be getting populated over here? <laughs> Meaty shots. Ooh! It's a pint. There's no way I can do that in one. Nah, I say Actual holy guacamole. <laughs> 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 
Shake it back if you don't. Get it Thank you. <laughs> I was just going to say, you should, you should keep dinner to the pen. Look, I've got acid reflux, so we have. <laughs> Been diagnosed with a condition. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. That's a pint, mate. See, when I was recording him, like by doing him pouring that, I was like, this is going on a very long time. To health and goodwill. Cheers to love. Cheers, Cheers to honour. <laughs> Oh, Stabigail, you champion. Mm -hmm. Oh, Megan and all. Mm -hmm. Sorry, she went first. Did you see Oh my fucking god. It doesn't even touch the sides. <laughs> Silly sausages are out. <laughs> Silly string. <laughs> we are <having> so <laughs> um, Hold out, fold out, shut it in. Oh, Megan. <laughs> hey, that's me. Come on, let her. that in the morning and you know what I use my skincare you already know you already know it's got to be skin in me so I've just started wiping my makeup off and then I'm going to cleanse cleanse my face I'm going to use my skin in me cleanser this is just the best my skin feels so good I'm clean go up that be dry clean as a whistle look at that clean 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 and then guys Close the door because this means business. When the real work comes in, this is when I use my Skin and Me Daily Dozer. Oh, that's upside down. My Skin and Me Daily Dozer, and you'll see this says for Megan. That has my name on it for a reason. Not just for show, not just to look cute, but because this is skincare tailored to me for my skin and my skin goals. So basically with Skin and Me, how it works, if you're not already aware, so I've been buying on for this for about two years. So if you don't know, I'm gonna be shocked, but I'll still explain it to you. If you're a newbie here, that's absolutely fine. If you're new to Skin and Me, you'll realize that you, first of all, fill out a sort of questionnaire form and you're gonna let Skin and Me know, okay, this is what I don't like about my skin. These are goals I'd like to achieve with my skin. You're going to send them some pictures and someone from their dermatology team is really going to assess that and decide what is best for you and your skin. You can trust that this has active ingredients in it that you're going to pop on before you go to sleep and through the night this is going to work on your skin. So this is designed literally for you. It doesn't mean it's the same as what your best friend has, your boyfriend has, your family has. This is designed just for you, for you and your skin goals. Genuinely, before I used skin in me, my skin was a hot mess. And that's fine, because how are you expected to walk into a drugstore shop, right, and be like, okay, my skin needs this, my skin needs that. So, I have a wee discount code. It is MEGOMARCH. You can use my code MEGOMARCH to get your first ever daily doser for only £4.99. And you can have personalised skincare tailored to you and your skin goals. And with my code MEGOMARCH, you can also add a trial of the cleanser, SPF, moisturiser and serum all for free. Use my code Mega March and get your first ever daily dozer for just £4.99 and say hello to personalised skincare. Now I'm off to my bed, which is much required, but I might eat a wee pizza first. Hey guys, good morning. <sighs> we now we go just went a wee run. We done a wee 3k in the bag. It was. 
Uh, it's actually so warm today. I mean, I don't know if it's just because we were running naturally, it is a bit warmer, but <clears throat> I do think it's pretty promising. So we're going to get ready. We've got one wee job, well, two wee jobs technically to shoot before we head out for the day. Me and Abigail actually got booked for a wee joint job for South Beach. How cute. Yep. So this is going to be on my page. Got a little shells going on. <laughs> and then Abigail's got a wee one with like these sort of flubbers on it. So we'll be matching in both. Under my eyes, it's pure sweating. I know, me too. Woo! Right, let's get ready. And I'm going to vlog lots today. I promise. I promise. Bonjour. <laughs> Guys, I keep saying uh, thank you in French. You say merci. Um, but we got all our work done and now the sun is bloody shining. I didn't know if it was just the sweat. We were working up for our wee 3k this morning or if the sun was out. But I'll tell you what, the sun is out. Look at my legs. I'm starting to think I should have bloody SPF. I've got SPF on, up, F, SPF on my face. <laughs> No, we should get our fans in in the back, right? So, me and Abby... Megan, you tell your vlog, but tell my vlog. Okay, so me and Abby were taking a wee picture and we're just like, as you do, wee pout, right? It's really not that offensive, we're also in 2024. And this lady who has leather biker gloves on, <laughs> it's like that. Like, <laughs> trying to get my attention, and I turn around and she's going this way. Was she trying to get Yeah, she was like yeah, waving at like, me. Ah, uh -huh. and she's going this. You, yeah. I was like, what? The, what are you actually doing? And then I turned around and I said, what's so funny? And they're like this. Could you see it? No, our pals are honestly on face lift number three. That woman's pure skin. So bizarre. I mean, if you'd done that in Glasgow, you'd get absolutely skilled. Uh, do you know what the thing is? See, in Glasgow, if you continue to stare the way that. So you're like, yeah, that's what's your problem. People would say, like my mum would say, sorry, you all right? Yeah. And my mum would though. Can I help? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> my mum always says, take a picture. Yeah, same. <laughs> but we did though today, remember on the way back from shop, we, that's when we missed Pure Sterminate, we were like, hi. She was like, hi. And I thought, well, why else are you looking? I keep getting a wedgie. But now we're at Cappuccino, Hotel Cappuccino. Um, we came here the other day for a wee drink. Yeah, just let Megan vlog on my vlog. And now we're here for dinner and drinks. Woo! We've got a wee Moscow meal. Well, lunch, yeah. Abby got a Moscow meal. Me. Yeah, because we're going to a place called Rokito tonight, which is like a really popular Italian. Mm -hmm. And then myself, Abigail and Monique got a strawberry daiquiri. Out here they are chef's kiss. That's what they're kind of known for, aren't yeah. they? Yeah. So it's yeah. so gorgeous. May this weather continue because we are living the vida loca. Yeah, by the way, this is what a difference this is to day one. Yeah. Oh, it was perishing. It was chilly Baltic. <laughs> Same. Same. The this sun on my yeah. skin. This is what we needed. This is what we came for. Yeah. This is what we this needed. This is what we came for. Get in my belly. <laughs> yes. Yes, 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 yes. Hello. My makeup's definitely seen better days, but look at this cute wee Italian one. There's me and Harry. Cool kids eat pizza. Anyway, it's really, really cool. And I got a pasta called Lady in the Tramp. How cute is that? Very good. Hey, chicken nuggets. Sorry, this is quite possibly the worst vlog I've ever attempted. Um, slap on the wrist, silly girl, Megan. Um, but we try again. We're, I'm ready for the day. I look like a jumbo-sized toddler, so don't get a fright. <laughs> I actually look like someone's put a spell on a, a child and I've grew to be five foot eight, which is quite scary actually, but this is this is what we're working with. <laughs> the shorts, the shorts are cute, but not oh fuck, I don't know. It's too late now, I'm not getting changed. I can't be fucked. I'm doing my period, it's gonna start any second. So I'm not here to faff around with outfits. Also, speaking of being doing my period, I'm so hungry. <coughs> I ate um uh, we bowl a special K this morning and I, I'm ravenous. I feel like I've not eaten about 5,000 years. So we're going to go into Palma and get a wee brunch. We've not done that yet. We've had, we went for lunch, but we've not went for brunch. So we're going to do that. And then tonight we're actually going to have a wee night in. So I'll be sure to vlog that. Right? I promise. I've got a wee stash of Oreos. I'm actually going to have one. How good are Oreos, by the way? So underrated. The first one always gets a bit soggy, so I'm going to skip the first. 
and move to the second. I'm really needing a wee caffeine hit. What's weird is my period is like clockwork, right? Oh, I took the... Mmm. Mmm. I love Oreos. So, <clears throat> why do I always do this? Take a bite and then proceed to talk. Rude. Rude, rude, rude. I got this little hat yesterday and she had a various and I was maybe going to alert, wear it with this but I've just freshly washed the hair so I thought I'll keep the hair doing. Um, <clears throat> my period's like clock, 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 sorry, clockwork, right? So it always comes on the 5th of the month and it didn't come yesterday, today's the 6th but then I realised it was February and it might have been a leap year, right? So it was one extra day but February's still a shorter month than the rest. How smart that I reached that conclusion on my own. So I'm assuming it's going to start today, and I think it will, considering how hungry I feel. Mm -hmm. How are we all doing, girls? <laughs> the vibes are high. Is <laughs> <laughs> Abigail? Hi! Abby? <coughs> Monique? Hi! Bless you, honey. Oh, bless you. Hey, I've got Oreos stuck in my teeth and I've got a big black teeth. <laughs> I like this nice, I like it. I like it as well. I just look like a really big toddler. I know I normally look like a toddler, but I feel like an extra toddler today. Toddlers are cute when you're not 26. <laughs> um, yeah, no, it looks so cute. I need to stop calling my 26, myself 26. I've still got a couple of months being 25. But I feel like you just reached reach that, like you're on the cusp. I may as well be 26 at this point. Made it to brunch. This is mine's. All the girls look much more <laughs> overwhelming. Mine is a bit underwhelming. Guys, you know what really makes me feel like I am 25? is that this is just perfect to me, a wee glass of wine. Although, you could say I'm a bit immature having this wee ice cube in here. But Monique showed me last night how to actually hold the wine glass here. And if you want to t taste your wine, you're gonna do swivel, swivel, swivel. Snap, snap, you need to keep it in your mouth and sort of swish it about like you would with Listerine. And that is how you try your wine. So I've got a wee rosé, olives obviously, and this couldn't be any better. Guys, I forgot to tell you this yesterday, right? But I went to a psychic like just before I came here. And I'll tell you in time more about the psychic appointment. However, one of the like really key things she said to me, and she was so precise by the way, like so spot on, everything I was like, having to literally pick my jaw up off the ground. And one of the things she said was, Archangel Michael is like really looking over you right now and like he's watching over you and he follows you. And Archangel Michael is like the chief of the angels, right? So say, say you worked in River Island and everyone's a shop assistant and then there's a manager. That's what Archangel Michael is of the angel world apparently, right? So she said to me, he's really following you and I never heard of this bloke before, so didn't really, didn't really think too much about it. I was walking through Palma yesterday and for some reason a statue caught my eye, which is quite unusual. Turn round to look at a statue and Archangel Michael was on, on the plaque and a statue of him in Palma, Mallorca. He's came to Palma, Mallorca with me. This man travels far and wide just to protect me and wow. I, honestly, I genuinely like had a wave of sheer shock. How weird is that? And nice. Comforting. I can't wait for Wednesday. Yeah, I've got Abby to book the psychic and I'm really excited for her. Obviously psychics is like sometimes they can have a block or some people get a better reading than other people but I have huge faith nah, in you good. getting a good reading. You've done amazing reading to be honest. I know it's not for everyone, but I find so much peace in it. So, might have to start paying rent here. Hotel Cappuccino, we're back. This is like a wee sun trap. The sun, the sun is moving away just now, but um, it's just the vibes are here. The vibes are immaculate, the food's immaculate. We had a wee cheesecake there. Now we've got another wee <coughs> bottle of 
blush is blush and rosé the same thing cool thanks everyone <laughs> uh, I would say, well, I don't is know. Is blush and rosy the same thing? My mother would say no. I know. Mm. Yeah. Honey, I'm home. Guys, we're back in the apartment. I've got celebrity cat sprays on. You know, I'm really, really, really good at this. Like, should I ever become a celebrity one day and be of status on this show? Get me on it. I'll win it. Biggest wad of cash off to charity. I'm so good at that. But we're back home and we're having our wee night in. We went to the supermarket, Mercado? Mercado. Mercado. And stocked up on dinner. Look at Abby, bless her. Absolute mob of the group, taking care of us all. Um, Abby, Abigail and Monique are upstairs. We've got our wee, what would you call this again? Like wee pick a bits? Like antipasti. Um, some salad there. Um, we've got some pizzas in the oven. We've got some lattice fries, mozzarella dippers, bolognese. Whoa! Oh, geez. <laughs> Singe them off. See, when you do that, you'll never know your eyelashes stick together. Well, that's what just happened. <laughs> um, so, we've got all the good stuff. I'm buzzing for a wee, di wee dinner like this, to be honest. And we're just going to have a wee cozy night in. Yay! Woo! Oh, this is exactly what I've been after, you know. Cheers, Abby! Woo! <laughs> hey, y'all! It's our last day in Mallorca! Awesome. Um, but the whole gang's out. And... <laughs> oh, I'm so sick of it. Sorry. Oh, you want rid of me or something? No, I was trying, is that what it is? I was trying to do, like, a low tone <laughs> on her vlog, like... <laughs> Abby's death was wanting rid of me. <laughs> She's had enough. It's like it hurts. But today I think we're going to pack our suitcases and then we're going to go into the spa. Oh, I forgot to tell you about our friends. Oh. So me and Abigail the other night went to the bar like in the hotel just to have a wee glass of wine or two. And this couple were a bit next to us and they were like, Sorry, sorry for eerie wigging, but we heard a Scottish accent <laughs> um, and then we got talking to them. Two guys were so nice. Oh, Thanks. thank you. <laughs> There's all the golfers it. Um, <laughs> is it golfers what we're staying on? There's lots of golfers. Yeah, these two guys, they were so funny and oh, they were just, they were so nice. They honestly had us in stitches, but they were such nice guys. I wonder if we might see them today because they were the ones that told us about the spa in the hotel. I look naked, I'm not. I have a bikini on. We're at the spa, look what I've got our feet in. A little food spa. We had to put some of these in it. And then it's like a crazy feet. Actually, I'm so embarrassed we're wearing a bikini. Not that there's anything wrong with body hair, but I'm supposed to be a wax two hours ago and I forgot I had it booked obviously because I'm in Mallorca. And my wax girl, bless her, messaged me like, hey babe, like, are you still coming? I was like, I never do shit like that. I'm the most organized person ever, so it's very out of character. I was like, I'm so sorry, like, let me cover the appointment. But she was like, don't worry, don't worry, you can just come on your back. So I do need the wax. I did take a razor to the bikini line for the first time in two years the other day, but I'm not doing it again. I cannot shave down there. It's just a hot mess. I mean, this smells nice, but I don't understand. This guy's spitting out ice, let's see. Come on, pal. Do it. Do it. Oh, there. See, something like sauna in here. Oh, it's hot, hot, hot. Hot, 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 hot. Guys, we know I always get cuddly toys on holiday. Don't know what I want to pick. <laughs> Abigail, show them what they can do. <laughs> oh, he's a wee girl. Oh, there's Here's Ozzy. Ozzy. Aww. Ozzy Osbourne? Oh. Is that what you called him after? Uh, no. <laughs> oh my god, Ozzy's dead quiet. I've never heard Ozzy be so quiet in his life. 
Look what I got. Mm. You know, people have a lot to say about people who like bounties, and you know what I say to that? All of you. This is amazing, the bounty ice cream. So, you know, you get like the Mars ones and the Snickers ones. This is where it's at. Now watch me whip. Watch me nae nae. <laughs> Do the stank leg. So let the dog down. <laughs> Last night babes. We've got a wee. Yep we do. Cheers honey. Ching ching. Guess how much this set is back. <laughs> <laughs> now you know if you watch the Paris vlog, me and Abigail get really expensive taste for wine, and this was one euro eighty cent. <laughs> Woo! Absolute bargain. Mm. That sounded like. Guess how much this French for like. <laughs> <laughs> um, why is that in Europe? Is are the grapes from here or something? I know, it's, why is it so cheap? We're going to, I can never remember the place of this name. The place of this name? The place of this name. <laughs> La Rosa? Yeah, La Rosa. Like, um, so we're going there. This has been Abigail's wee toilet, so this is what we've been doing every night, getting ready in here. Yep. Um, so we tapas dinner tonight. I'm excited for this actually. Couple of bottles of blush. That'll be delicious. To end the old trippio. Give me, give me more, give me more, give me, give me more. <laughs> Look at our wee spicy marks. Look at the wee this. That is so cute. Did I show you this already? Maybe, but it was a bad mood. We brought this out too. I'm back. I'm back, and it. I, I thought that was someone dropping stuff. This is wee beads. Oh, is it spicy? Um, we're in La Rosso for dinner. We've ordered lots of wee bits and bobs. I'm going to do a wee taste test of my spicy mark. It's the first spicy mark of a holiday, by the way. <laughs> it does, doesn't it? Mmm, that's nice. Mm -hmm. We're in a wee bar. Everyone say hi. 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 We're going to do a wee taste test of our. Is that popcorn? Popcorn. Yeah. We're going to taste test of popcorn. Mmm. Okay. Take me now, be trying this. Cheers. And uh, uno, dos, tres. Mm, that is spicy, that yeah. pop, the pop first spice. Uh -huh. mm. Yes, sir. Right, Minnie's up first. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Megan Renee is really brutal. So, Maria. <laughs> <laughs> call someone and say I'll call you right back. <laughs> you need to call someone and say I'll call you right back. Hi, I'll need to call you right back. I can't talk right now. <laughs> <laughs> Says, sing your favourite song to the table behind you. I need to do a little bit. Who are they? Who are they? Yeah. I can almost see it. <laughs> that dream I dream ever. There's a voice inside my head saying, You'll never reach it. Did even bat an eye? Good morning guys. I think we all might be feeling a wee bit worse for wear. But this is your reminder that you can use my Skin and Me code. It's Mego March, and you can get personalised skincare tailored to you and your skin goals for just £4.99 instead of £24.99. So huge, huge saving. Oh, oh. 
Head down to the link in the bio, get yourself signed up, use my code MEGOMARCH. Not only does that get you your first daily doser for just £4.99, you can also get some free trials of the cleanser, the SPF, the moisturiser, the serum. There's a lot to try out and have fun with. And on that note, guys, I'm just packing up. The weather's a wee bit shit. I think that is the sign to get home. We'll get back to Glasgow, honey. So that's something to do. We're all checked in, but we're sitting ourselves on the plane. I'm not annoyed because I can read my book. I'm reading the uh, follow-up of It uh, Ends With Us by Colin Hoover. I'm hooked. Love Colin Hoover, so I'll sit and read that on the plane. Um, but I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Sorry if it wasn't my most um, exciting vlog in the world, but it has been a wee bit of a quieter trip because um, we're not staying like directly in Palma and it's out of season, so not many people are on holiday. People are just here to play golf, really. So I vlogged what I can and I hope you enjoyed. And as always, I really appreciate you joining me and I will see you in the next video. Remember, listen to our podcast, Roller Coasting. Bye!